My name's Marie Clark, I'm an artist and I'm also connected to the traditional lands where the National Gallery is situated. If you were an Aboriginal person living in the southeast of Australia, you would have had a possum skin cloak because of the climate down here and everybody would have needed a possum skin cloak to keep warm. So as you grew, your cloak grew with you, which told the story of who you were, your connection to country, culture, place and family. And it was basically your autobiography and it told your story on your cloak. Traditionally, possum skin cloaks were etched with a mussel shell or possum jaw bone or the kangaroo incisor teeth. But today, because the cloaks or the pelts have been chemically tanned, we use a burning tool to scorch our designs into the cloak. As well as doing that, we also use wattle resin mixed with ochre to make the, the colourful paint that goes onto the cloak. For my 63 pelt possum skin cloak, I have decided to mark it with all the different countries and language groups that I'm connected to. And you'll see two pelts or two countries represented on there with green ochre. And they represent my connection to Tipperary in Ireland and Dunstable in the UK, which are both my great-grandparents five times back. So now that I've told you my story and my journey on my possum skin cloak, I'd like you to have a little think about how you might tell your story on your possum pelt. And whether that's going to your grandmother's house or going to the shops or going to your friend's place or walking to school, it's a journey and a path that you will take you know, every other day, and how might that look as a design on your possum pelt? It's your turn to make drawings of the places that are special to you and the journeys that you've made in your life. Mm -hmm.